Hello friends, and it is Vlogmas day 24, and I'm super excited. It is a little after nine o'clock. My sister's on the way to the hotel to pick me up, and we're probably going to go take care of a couple things, and then I have packed my Louis Vuitton duffel to just spend the entire day there. My pajamas are there to put on later this evening, and we will just be spending a family, family day playing games, puzzles, all the things. Um, wearing a really cute oversized denim shirt, my green festive coat, and then, of course, my golden goose and a really great pair of black, like, trousers that are, like, cropped but it's supposed to be like 50 degrees today. It's gonna to be nice and easy and breezy, but we're going to make it a great, great day. I got up around 5.30 this morning, did a really great hour long workout. Um, the gym here, you have to reserve your time and they're only letting one person in at a time. So I got a really great workout in my hour and no one was around. So you were able to just like really use every machine you needed to wipe them all down. It felt very safe and clean. Had some coffee this morning. Steven went for a walk to the Starbucks and then he has to go get new pants. The reason Steven has to go buy pants is because when we were at the lounge at the Buffalo airport, I was editing and I had my laptop plugged in in the little seating area that we were at. And when I pulled my laptop, I spilled an entire glass of red wine all over him and it soaked through his pants. He had to go and change in the lounge bathroom and he had to throw the pants out because they were completely stained. So he is actually going to walk to the Starbucks and then go shopping for some pants to replace them. And then he's gonna hop over to my sister's right after that. So he'll probably be there a little bit later in the morning. But that's what's happening. We're gonna make it a great day. You're gonna have lots of family time. You're gonna see fancy dinner tonight. And thank you for all the love on last night's video. Um, this is exactly what my heart and soul needed and I'm so happy. So my sister will be here shortly and then we're gonna get rocking and rolling. Hi Crosby. Hi gorgeous. Hi lovey. Hi. We're so quiet and calm. So we are still puzzling. Shelby and Allison are making sugar cookies. We have Home Alone 2 playing. All the things. Puzzle progress. We have it starting to come together. It is a harder, it's a hard puzzle. Uh -huh. Mom is making her vegetable pizza. Her secret family recipe. <laughs> it's on Pinterest. <laughs> Look Nothing under, beats it though. Look under vegetable pizza. I feel like so many family events always have a vegetable pizza. And then here are their sugar cookies. Yeah, when growing up, every you Everyone always had a vegetable yeah. pizza. Growing up. You don't think or many people do it yeah. anymore? Or taco. <gasps> I haven't had taco dip in forever. Yeah, that was always the thing. Now they don't. It's too much work for people. <laughs> is it okay? And then these are the sugar cookies, and then Sis is going to start her beef wellington. She also has a sourdough starter over here that is sort of bubbling. I need a name for her. She needs a name. I need to call it her. I mean, I don't know. She looks like a Josephine. <laughs> I do want like a Victorian name for her. What's another Victorian name? Can we call, can we call her the missing Bronte sister? Emily. <laughs> Prudence. Prudence. Prudence is good. Call her Prue. Prue. Yeah. Yes. Prue my. Prue needs to prove. Prue my sour starter. Sourdough starter. And then Shelbs is over there still working on the puzzle. Oh, and then it's like Great British Bake Off. Yes. And all the things. Her name is Prue. Well, her name is Prudence, but we'll call her Prue for short. Yeah. Alright, what's the next step? Cutting vegetables. <laughs> Hence the vegetable pizza. Are you doing tomatoes? That's always a that's always up for debate. Well, you can pick the tomatoes off. No, I like tomatoes oh. now. Mm, we have the tomatoes. Grape or diced? Okay. Oh, 
Okay, that I was going to say. They have to be grouped together. There's a Christmas Eve crisis. <laughs> Sis, would you like to inform them of the crisis we are facing? Publix <laughs> is doing me dirty, Dolly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you made a Dolly reference. Publix is the, the equivalent of the Dolly Parton advent calendar. She was supposed to get spinach. And we have no spinach. And twice a month Oh no, Shelby. The caprice is ruined. A caprice is nothing except tomatoes and basil. What's, without fan- what's happening to fancy dinner? <laughs> so fancy. Here's your one chance, fancy. Don't let me down. Steven also made a friend. He's over here with Ty, the cat. Yeah, she, literally, she literally screamed it. Well, I tried picking her up and she meowed and hissed at me. So, she's... That's all power goes. All right, so we are on a mission to get spinach to save Christmas Eve. Fancy dinner is in action. This is a really cute caprese salad that Shelby made. Crushed it. That's it is really cute. Mom made a cheese ball the size of a volleyball. Within the vegetable. And then we have the vegetable pizza, which you saw in action. Mom, your cheese ball got a little. Well, it's for two days. Oh, it's a two-day cheese ball. This is called a 48-hour cheese ball. All the things. My sister also has the really cute Williams Sonoma plates. What are they called again? Twas the night. Oh my. <laughs> they were really cute. Mm-hmm. <laughs> They're so cute. We'll just call her Miss Wellington. Yeah, whatever. Look at this. It is literally look at the how perfect it is. And some roasted potatoes, and then some carrots in the oven made by the amazing Allison. Those look spectacular. <laughs> They're Instagram worthy. Yeah, it needs to be on the platter before we take a picture. <laughs> Watch mom drop it. <laughs> oh no. There it goes. They look really good. This is the part of the baking show <laughs> that uh, things go awry. Me- we need to fast music. Just one this way? Yeah. Whatever ways, yeah. Um, you don't even have a soggy bottom. I think we need to let him rest, though, before we Yeah, I said them. to let it rest. <laughs> you got this glow. <laughs> Here. Okay, let's put that in the oven so it kind of is out of the way. Okay. And I'll find it two weeks later when I, I do that, that too. Wrap him snugly in strips of cloth and laid him in a manger. You will find a baby wrapped snugly in strips of cloth lying in a manger. Suddenly the angel was joined by a vast host of others, the armies of heaven, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven and peace on earth to those with whom God is pleased. But Mary kept all these things in her heart and thought about them very often. The shepherds went back to their flocks, glorifying and praising God for all they had heard and seen. It was just as the angel had told them. Ooh, that... Uh (laughs) Uh-oh. Don't set the couch on fire. Round yon virgin mother and child, holy infant so Are we doing spoons first or by Felicia first? You buy Felicia for the spoons you don't have to think about. Okay. Is it a for tire that it's easy to play? Okay. Do we put on, put Someone on. should start reading by Felicia rolls. And then I'll put on L right now and let it play. Okay. Yeah, sounds perfect. I feel like this is going to go to one of these. Daddy's going to finish. Yeah. Not having a rectangle or square bread makes it so much harder to do that. When do you ever do the border at the end? They're just so weird. They're weird shaped now. Yeah, it's like I thought they would be rectangles. 
This has to go on this side. I'm coming. That's what I got. That's awesome. Feel how heavy it is. Do you like Sherlock Holmes? Yeah. I've already read one for school. Stephen, have you read Sherlock Holmes? You're going to be like 42 when you're finished with this. It's only... 1,173 pages. It's like Gone with the Wind. We're missing pieces, I think. You've got to be kidding me. We're missing one piece. No, we're missing... You've got to be kidding me. We're missing the one piece, don't we? We are missing one piece, but look how good it is. Ugh. It's still a success. We are in PJs. We just played by Felicia. Do we agree that by Felicia is a good one? Yeah. yeah. Yes, we loved it. We played some spoons. We finished our puzzle. I have to say I three-peated. I won oh, all geez. the rounds of spoons oh, and by Felicia. Oh, and we have a room full of sore losers. Oh, I totally won. As we played, Steven and Dad and Brad were watching Elf and yeah. Good times. People have been asking from yesterday about this puzzle board that my sister has, and it is by Bits and Pieces. Yeah, I got it off of Amazon. She got it on Amazon. Yeah. Sis is making and preparing breakfast for tomorrow, and we're all just chilling. Before we end this vlog, I actually have day 24 of our advent calendars to share with you, so let's cut to that. Alrighty, day 24. The last day of Beekman, we got a honey orange blossom soap. Oh, does that smell amazing? You could smell it the instant you opened it up. 24, 24 is right here. It's the last one. They really outdid themselves. It's an Eau de Perfume. And what fragrance is it? It's Ocean. I saved this one for today. So we are back on track. Day 24, last candle of Value Spa. And we got white cypress. Oh, it smells just like a Christmas tree. Day 24. Whoa, we just got a larger hand cream. I'm going to the most moisturized hands on the planet. I hope this is a tree. <gasps> and it is. And there is our final scene, all 24 days. Pour some sugar on me in the name of love. We got bonbons. I have never been happier to say goodbye. Give me some street talk, street talk. This calendar was bad. Straight talk, straight talk. It really made me sad. If you guys know that's straight talk from her movie, the theme song. Day 24. And there are multiple things in here. So there are gummy butterflies and gumdrops. Let's see what fell in this one. There were some gummies in here that fell. Some gummies in here that fell. And I think those are all, oh, hello, Dolly, well, goodbye. Dolly, it was a terrible experience, don't you know? It's been swell. Dolly, I won't buy you again, Dolly. Oh my goodness, I love you. I despised you. I'll tell you what I want, what I really, really want. So tell me what you want, what you really, really want. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna really, really find sea salt with saffron. That is day 24. We have all these spices. I will share with them in future vlogs as I cook with them. Super pumped. Successful advent calendars. All done, Bubby. Very good. Bye, Dolly. We have to finish yours. I know. So friends, we have reached day 24 of Vlogmas and it has been an absolute joy. I am debating whether or not I'll film tomorrow. Technically, I could wrap it up today and if I choose to do that, awesome. 
If I choose to film tomorrow, awesome as well. I guess we'll just have to see and what I feel led to do. But I have loved this Vlogmas so much. I love that it was simple and easy, low stress, and that it wasn't about pushing products and product placement nonstop and unboxings and shenanigans like that. It just felt really good about connection, treating ourselves kindly, learning some lessons along the way, sharing some laughs, and remembering what all of this is truly about. I hope that you have enjoyed it as much as I have enjoyed doing it for all of you. With that, I'm going to sign off. I don't know if I'll film tomorrow, so be on the lookout. But I'm gonna sign it off like I sign off all of them. Take care of yourself, take care of others, be kind, kindness is free, give it to everyone. Until next time, which may be tomorrow, it may not be, but I'll keep you posted. Bye-bye.